This is Gwen coming to you from Fate of the Empress, and I am continuing. This is part three of, I don't know how many, probably four, of my pet reset. And if you have stuck through it this far, bless you. Bless you, bless you. If not, it's okay. I understand. But what we're going to talk about right now is, if not in Hero, in pets, we're going to do this bloodline thing. So what Bloodline does is it just basically increases the basic stats elements for your pet. It's just another way of polishing your pet, I guess you could think of it that way. So it creates extra stats and then you can condense it and get a boost in some of that. And you have to use 800 of these magnolia berries for the first level of each um, pet. So I'm going to use 80 times, or you have to get 800 points. So I'm going to use 800 here and see how much that gives us towards that 800 points. So we're at half. So I'm going to try 80 again. And that's 800, so this is 1,600 total. And that got us over the edge. And then you condense using star anise. So this sort of like that wuxia, you know, cultivation type scenario. If you've ever seen wuxia or read wuxia books, then this is sort of that, you know, you build your inner strength sort of concept. So I definitely want my um, little chinchilla, which I name Yonbao, which means ingot. Yonbao. Because he has an ingot on his head. <laughs> it's a little on the nose, but, you know, it works. All right, so I definitely want to increase my bloodline for my Shiba Inu. And I'm going to do 150 this time. 1500 and see how that lands 821 so it is a little random for how much it takes to get you to that 800 it could be less than 150 it could be slightly more all right and then i'm gonna consolidate man i got so much star anise and not enough magnolia berries if if the developers are listening we need more magnolia berries please all right, I want to also take care of Jiao Chan. So I'm gonna try 140, oops, not 1140, 140. <laughs> and improve, almost. All right, let's say 10 more. All right, we got there. All right, and improve that. So it increases depending on the level, the tier, you're at it will increase a different stat each time so it tier 2 it unlocks 2800 28000 health actually which would be actually really really good for Jiao Chan and Zhuang Zhao so i might check his too yeah 28000 so i'm going to definitely going to come back and do that i might do that even over increasing mine yeah so they both need a lot of health and really this is all about concentrating on the stats that your hero or your mc need to make your team successful so i definitely need more hp for those characters so i'm gonna say yeah I'm going to do the second layer. Oops, not totem. I don't want totem. I want bloodline. And now there's inherit. Now that you have done the bloodline thing, you have to unlock the first level of bloodline, it looks like, in order for inherit to open. So inherit is where you can take one pet and put another empty pet next to it. And just like inherit for treasure, all of its upgrades and everything get 
moved over for 50 ingots instead of you having to reset and then re-manually do it over again like I've been doing. And I manually reset and did everything over because I wanted to get everything out and touch it and feel it and look at it. But you don't have to do that every single time. You can use Inherit once your bloodline is up the first tier. Alright, so need another 700. So I'm going to put uh, another 100 in and see how far that gets us. That's pretty close. I'm going to try 10 more. Pretty close. I don't want to overdo it. I just want to use just enough. Okay. 15, 19. That's really, really close. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and condense again and give the extra. Oh, I did it on the Shiva. Whoops. <laughs> this is what happens when Wen starts talking and forgets that there is actually work, you know, something I'm supposed to be doing. All right. Hopefully there's enough for me to continue doing this. I think it took like 20, so I'm going to do 15. And then 10 more. Maybe 5 more. Let's see. So I don't want to use too much. So I have enough for the next pet. Okay, there we go. All right, and then I'll increase that. I do it right? Bloodline zero, tier two, tier two, tier one. Oops. Nothing, nothing. All right. So the next one is the Raggedy Coon, so we can get that extra HP for Jiao Chan. So I'm going to try 120. Oops. Make sure you double check your numbers before you proceed because you do things like Wen does and accidentally get your wrong pet to tier 2. <laughs> Alright, there we go. And we've unlocked HP, which is really important. Oh, hey, Cassing, I would really, really love to DH right now, but I can't. Okay, so bloodline on the piggy. I need and the kitty cat. So I'm going to do 150 here. And oh, that, that really overshot. Perfect. I need more attack and Levi really does need more health, and so does Jaw. So I'm going to go ahead and do this again. Do 90 because it overshot. Alright, 20. Oops. I don't have enough to finish that one. That's okay. So I'll have to wait on Piggy and some other things, but you get the point. Tier 2, it's all about opening up and unlocking stats bonuses for Bloodline. So that's basically what you're looking for. Like, I don't feel like typing's attack is all that important right now. I might end up, because of this very fantastic two things with... Um, bloodline that I just realized I might end up switching um, Brave Kitty and Lock for Naranjita and Lock, so the, the Brave Kitty and this for <clears throat> each other and have Levi have Lock for the extra attack. That's a really fantastic amount of attack and HP. So I will do some thinking about that, but I'm going to try this set up first and see how it goes. I'll keep you posted. Thanks for watching, and this has been Bloodline with Wen. Questions, comments, please put them below. Think, and if you have suggestions or better information, please share, because Wen does not know everything. 
<laughs> Len knows very little actually, but I'm just willing to share what I know or what I think I know. So please feel free to correct me. Help each other out and have a great day.